Hello everyone, how are you all doing? In this video, we are going to talk about the iOS 18 Beta 5. Finally, Apple has released the iOS 18 Beta 5 and I am your boy Jay is here. We are going to talk about iOS 18 Beta 5. What's new here? This is my first impressions video, so I'm not yet. I have not yet dived in this update and looked for a lot of changes as of now because I just rushed to my studio to make video and tell you guys about what's new in this update and what's my first impressions on this update. Is it worth installing this update or how is this update performing on my iPhone 14 Pro? My name is Jay. You are watching Tech Hyped. If you're new here, consider hitting that subscribe button because I keep on making these type of videos for you guys and I don't want you guys to miss these. Also, please don't mind these b-rolls because i am not right now able to shoot so that's the reason you are right now seeing the shots that i shot earlier so yeah please bear with me but i just installed it on my device and in this video we are going to talk about how is it performing all right so the number one thing that is new here is the lock screen animation like this is a pretty small thing which you won't probably even able to notice if you can't uh, see it side by side but yeah when you unlock your iphone the apps animation that you see every time is a bit more faster and smoother and in general scrolling through the ui and animation of opening and closing apps all through the dynamic island and things like that the basic animations just feel a little bit more fluid and faster in response and the next thing that is new on the ios 18 beta 5 is the performance the performance alongside the animation the performance seems to be a little bit faster and actually noticeably faster compared to earlier so if you are having performance issue on your uh, current update which is ios 18 beta 4 you should definitely install this update because i can right away from installing this update i can notice that this is just so much better then talking about the battery life okay so first of all the battery life is something that is a bit too early for me to talk about right now because i just installed it on my device and i have to use my device for a rough part of two to three days at least to give you guys a brief overhaul about how is this update and should you install this update in terms of battery life but overall till now that i have my experience of using this update this seems pretty much the same it is not the best news because battery life on ios 18 beta 4 was already really really bad and i'm having a horrible experience so yeah fingers crossed i hope so that things get better on this update in terms of battery life but till now this does not really feel like battery life is anything better compared to earlier but still we have to wait and watch how is this update going to perform in terms of new features and changes i don't expect it to have any new features as such because it was a really small update it came at around 700 mb so yeah i don't have a lot of expectations from it because it is a small update and uh, in past also we have not really seen anything majorly new when it comes to features when we reach the ios uh, beta 5 mark but the one thing that is new that i discovered on this update is the distraction control feature in safari what this does is basically when you are reading an article and stuff like that and you just open uh, the view page and you will have these small ads and pop-ups just distracting you when enabled this will have a impact on it and it will just remove those distractions as the name suggests so that you can have a good experience of reading and articles and things like that also the photos app seems to be a little bit tweaked the settings and all the favorite tab and albums those are a little bit tweaked and a bit different compared to the previous beta but yeah we have seen a lot of small changes on the photos app ui since the first beta so yeah this is just a small change in photos app which you probably won't even notice but yeah there is that that's pretty much it for today's video thank you so much for watching this video till the end this is me jay aka tech hyped and i will be coming up with a hidden features and changes video i am working on it i am trying to dive deeper in this update and make video on it so make sure to hit that subscribe button because i want to reach 10.6k as soon as possible help me reach that goal peace out and have a great day everyone i will catch you guys in the very next episode